back at it. It's built on this logic. Found another article from the Science Direct. The topic is engineering and nanobots. And I'll put a link in the description to get to this article. And uh, basically, um, you know, they start this with the, uh, the miraculous anatomy of the digital immunity ecosystem. <sighs> these people are, these people are insane. The miraculous. It's nothing that they do is miraculous. It's magical. See, it's the difference in a miracle and magic. You see? So... As we go into this article, what is a uh, smart vaccine? Nanobot engineers is defined as the engineering of smart functional systems at the molecular scale. The nanotechnology dictionary um, defines nanotechnology as the design, characterization, production, and application of structures, devices, and system by control manipulation of size and shape at the nano scale, atomic, molecular, and macro molecular scale that produces structures, devices, and systems with at least one novel superior characteristics or property. Um, the SV is an intelligent nanobot programmable to do a specific function in digital immunity. And they go on further to um, explain this technology that they're using and uh, this is public information. And this is the kind of information we need to know what is going on with this uh, worldwide experiment that they're doing with these um, viruses that just keep popping up. And with these mandates, notice the term mandate. You know, it's not a law. It's not a law of nature. It's not a, you know, because they really don't have laws. They have codes. So the only laws are in nature. Okay, so a mandate, you know, it's, it's a magical word <laughs> because you might go for that bullshit, a mandate, a, a date, a specific time where you can tell a man what to do. And see, we know in nature, in the unit, there's no date and time on a man where you could tell a man or a woman what to do. Okay, it's like it's time for us to wake up and realize what's going on and, and the scheme that. Uh, these demons, these puppets, these smart dummies, you see, it's all the same. What they're trying to do by trying to force us to wear these goofy-ass, retarded-ass masks and sign up and get tested and have these swabs all up in our face and in our mouth and our nose and our ears wherever they could put whatever we'll let them put it they'll put it it's time to to wake up then you want to try to tell us we need to go get vaccinated it's like fuck that vaccine it's like we're not taking no damn vaccine you take that damn vaccine and see now the chickens come home to roost with the medical professionals realizing that damn now they're telling us we got to take it and, they, and see they got enough sense to know not to take it but they had no problem and doing the test and giving it to you though. But now it's come around where they're starting to say, you know what, we're not. <laughs> if they're not taking it, why would you think I would take it? And at this point in time, whoever hasn't taken it, it's, it's a pretty good chance that they're not going to take it. So you might as well stop with your fear tactics and your uh, mind control and your, you know, encouragement of getting it and your free uh, Chipotle and free Wi-Fi and free blunts and some free uh, gin and juice, some free uh, Corona beers and, you know, it's like you can keep all that free shit. It's like we don't want it. We don't want the, to, uh, we don't want to wear the mask. We don't want the vax. You know, it's like it's time to put an end to your little puppet scheme, okay?